Are you struggling to understand the dynamics of the divine masculine and feminine energies in your twin flame connection? Have you ever considered the importance of allowing the divine masculine to fail in order for true growth and union to occur? Join me in this insightful YouTube video where we delve into why it's crucial to let the divine masculine lead physically and the connection. Discover how embracing the divine feminine energy and rejecting lower vibrations can pave the way for a harmonious and fulfilling relationship. Watch till the end for valuable insights and don't forget to subscribe for more empowering content. The bubble love phase embodies the enchanting phase in the journey of encountering one's twin flame, where the connection is immersed in an ethereal harmony and a sense of perfect alignment. It's a period when the universe seems to conspire in favor of the union, providing a tantalizing preview of the soul's ultimate reunion. During this phase, individuals feel an unmatched sense of wholeness and unity, as if they have finally discovered their missing counterpart. Every interaction, glance, and touch feels suffused with an otherworldly vitality, drawing them nearer in a dance of cosmic synchronicity. This phase serves as a beacon of hope and affirmation, confirming the presence of a deep, soulful connection that surpasses the physical realm. It offers a peek into the potential of the relationship, revealing the profound depths of love and understanding awaiting exploration. However, while the bubble love phase offers a glimpse of the divine union, it marks just the beginning of a transformative journey. As the journey unfolds, individuals are tasked with navigating challenges, confronting inner obstacles, and undergoing profound growth to truly embody the union they have glimpsed. Yet, the memories and sensations of the bubble love phase act as a guiding force reminding them of the sacred bond they share and motivating them to continue forward on their path of spiritual evolution. As the journey of Twin Flames progresses, it often moves through various stages of development and transformation, characterized by shifts in energy dynamics between the divine masculine and feminine counterparts. One significant aspect of this progression is the phenomenon of an energy flip within the divine feminine. Initially, during the bubble love phase, there is a deep sense of harmony and completeness as the twin flames unite in perfect alignment. However, as the journey advances, the divine feminine may undergo a pivotal transformation where her energy flips, transitioning into an inverted state. This energy flip indicates a profound change in perspective and behavior. The divine feminine, formerly in a receptive and nurturing role, now embraces a more assertive and proactive stance. This inversion of energy can manifest in various ways, such as a heightened desire for independence, increased self-assertion, or a stronger need for boundaries. It is a natural aspect of the journey, signaling the divine feminine's progression towards self-discovery, empowerment, and alignment with her true essence. While this energy flip may initially disrupt the harmony of the connection, it ultimately catalyzes growth and evolution for both partners. It challenges the divine masculine to confront his beliefs and limitations while encouraging the divine feminine to fully embrace her power. Through this process of inner transformation and rebalancing of energies, the twin flames move closer to achieving union on a deeper, more authentic level. In the intricate dance of spiritual connection, the interplay of energies between the divine masculine and feminine mirrors, the dynamics of a battery system, like the positive and negative poles of a battery. These energies possess distinct polarities that must align correctly for the union to flourish. Just as placing a plus sign and a negative sign together with magnets results in effortless attraction, the initial stages of the twin flame journey often demonstrate a natural harmony when the correct polarity alignment occurs. However, as the journey unfolds, challenges arise when the divine feminine undergoes an energy flip transitioning into an inverted state. This inversion disrupts the natural energy flow, akin to reversing the polarity of a battery, causing repulsion rather than attraction. The divine masculine, embodying a giving, active energy, may begin to withdraw in response to this energetic imbalance. To restore balance and facilitate the progression of the union, it becomes essential for the divine feminine to realign with her receptive magnetic energy. By granting the Divine Masculine the space to lead physically and energetically, the union can regain its natural flow. 
cells. Similar to a battery charging system, correct polarity alignment is crucial for the energies to seamlessly come together, fostering a deeper connection and facilitating the journey towards union and completeness. Healing and self-love serve as foundational pillars on the path towards a harmonious and fulfilling connection, especially in the realm of twin flame relationships. The importance of these elements cannot be overstated as they lay the groundwork for profound transformation and growth. One must embark on a journey of self-reflection, confronting and healing old wounds and traumas that may have accumulated over time. By addressing these challenges directly, individuals can release the burdens of the past and pave the way for emotional liberation. Furthermore, the journey towards self-love is a transformative process that entails fully and unconditionally accepting oneself. It involves embracing all facets of one's being, including the shadow self, and learning to cultivate compassion and forgiveness towards oneself. Through this journey, individuals can shed layers of self-doubt and insecurity, revealing their inherent worth and value. As individuals heal and nurture a profound sense of self-love, they become better equipped to engage authentically in relationships, including with their twin flame. This journey is not merely about seeking external validation or completion in another person, but rather about recognizing one's intrinsic worthiness and completeness. By doing so, individuals can approach relationships from a place of wholeness, contributing to mutual growth and harmony. Ultimately, healing and self-love serve as essential stepping stones on the path towards realizing the true potential of a twin flame connection. The divine feminine energy embodies a magnetic allure similar to the pull of the moon. Like the lunar force that influences the tides, the divine feminine draws in with a gentle yet potent magnetism. It is a receptive energy akin to the moon's ability to reflect the light of the sun. Instead of actively giving, the divine feminine energy receives, allowing the flow of abundance and love to naturally enter. This receptive nature is not about passivity, but rather about being attuned to the rhythms of the universe. Just as the moon waxes and wanes, the divine feminine knows when to expand and when to contract. It is a dance of ebb and flow, of opening and closing, of allowing and releasing. In a twin flame connection, the divine feminine's role is to create space for the divine masculine to step into his power. By being receptive, she invites him to lead, to take action, and to pursue the connection with determination and strength. Embracing the divine feminine energy entails surrendering to the flow of life, trusting in the process, and being open to receiving the blessings that the universe has to offer. It is a state of deep self-awareness and acceptance, where one finds strength in vulnerability and beauty in receptivity. Allowing space for change is an essential aspect of personal growth and transformation. It involves acknowledging that change takes time and requires patience, consistency, and determination. Whether in the journey of self-improvement or in nurturing relationships, allowing this space is crucial for natural progress to unfold. Consistency forms the foundation upon which change is built. It entails committing to small, daily actions that align with your goals or intentions. Whether it involves practicing self-care routines, developing a new skill, or working on communication and relationships, consistency fosters habits that lead to long-term change. However, consistency alone may not suffice. Determination provides the drive to persist when faced with obstacles or setbacks. It is the unwavering resolve to stay dedicated to your goals, even amidst challenges. With determination, challenges become opportunities for growth and setbacks become valuable lessons. By allowing space for change, individuals and relationships can evolve organically over time. It is about trusting the process, embracing the journey, and understanding that transformation is a gradual, ongoing process that demands both patience and perseverance. In the intricate dance of twin flame connections, each individual embodies distinct energetic roles, with the divine masculine assigned a profound mission. Central to their role is the imperative to overcome obstacles in pursuit of the divine feminine. This metaphorical mountain represents the barriers, challenges, and distances that may separate the two souls. Whether it is physical distance, emotional hurdles, or societal norms, 
The divine masculine is summoned to demonstrate unwavering determination and resilience. By allowing the divine masculine to take the lead in surmounting these obstacles, a crucial balance is struck within the relationship dynamic. It is through their efforts that the connection is strengthened and propelled towards union. This act of overcoming obstacles symbolizes not only a physical journey but also a spiritual and emotional pilgrimage towards unity and completeness. However, the key lies in granting the divine masculine the space and agency to undertake this monumental task. It is essential for the divine feminine to relinquish control and trust in the divine masculine's ability to navigate the challenges that arise. This act of surrendering control does not imply passivity but rather an acknowledgement of the divine masculine's inherent strength and purpose. Ultimately, by honoring the divine masculine's role and allowing them to fulfill their mission, both partners contribute to the co-creation of a harmonious and deeply fulfilling union. Rejecting lower vibrations is a fundamental aspect of the journey towards union and twin flame connections. The Divine Feminine is tasked with discerning and rejecting any behavior or energy that does not resonate with high vibrational frequencies. This entails cultivating a profound sense of self-worth and self-love, enabling the Divine Feminine to recognize and honor their own value. By establishing boundaries and standards for what they will accept in their relationship, the Divine Feminine empowers themselves in their connection. Embracing the highest version of their twin flame necessitates the Divine Feminine to create room for growth and transformation. It involves seeing beyond temporary flaws or shortcomings and envisioning the optimal potential of their partner. However, this does not entail accepting behavior or energy that contradicts the highest good of both individuals. It requires courage and strength to stand firm in one's convictions and to communicate them effectively. Rejecting lower vibrations is a form of self-care and self-respect, signaling to the universe and to their twin flame that the Divine Feminine is deserving of love and respect in return. Through this process, both individuals are encouraged to evolve and elevate their connection to a higher vibrational frequency, ultimately leading to a more profound and fulfilling union. If you're feeling extra generous and want to support our channel, Consider sending a super thanks by clicking on button right below this video or the three dots. It looks like a heart within a dollar sign. By clicking on it, you can choose to make a small contribution to our channel. Your contribution helps us to keep bringing you valuable content and fuels our passion for creating. We're grateful for your support. Can't wait to see your super thanks messages. In conclusion, embracing the journey of the divine masculine and feminine energies is not just about finding love, but about self-discovery and spiritual growth. By allowing the divine masculine to fail, we create space for transformation and alignment with our true selves. Remember, true union comes from within, from loving and accepting ourselves fully. So let go of the need to control and instead surrender to the flow of divine energy. Thank you for joining me on this enlightening journey. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more valuable insights and guidance on navigating the twin flame